Sanders, it's Christy from ChristyCoronmetal.com and welcome to this week's um, Make It Monday. And this week we're going to be focusing on this card here today and we're going to be utilising the Petal Gardens Designer Series paper. So let's get started. So first off I am going, it's got some scrap piece of Whisper White cardstock here and my greening comes from the Thankful Thought stamp set and I'm going to use this green down here. So I'm going to ink this up using my Black Memento ink. And I'm going to do the double stamping technique. So I've got my Stampin' Magic in place. And then I'm going to ink it up and stamp it again. See what that looks like. So I've got one of my circles here from my um, circle framelit dies. And I'm just going to hold that in place with some washi tape and run it through my Big Shot machine and then we'll be back. So this is what it looks like now that it's come back. So bring in my other elements here. So I have a piece of rich razzle berry cardstock and this piece measures nine inches by four and a half inches and then I've scored at the four and a half inch mark to create a four and a half by four and a half card base. I then have a piece of my petal garden designer series paper that is cut at four and three eighths by four and three eighths. But this image here um, and it's been cut at four inches by four inches and a piece of vellum that's cut at four inches by four inches as well. So I'm going to stick this piece here down and you can use whatever adhesive you prefer. I just like liquid adhesive at the moment. So I'm going to center and stick this down leaving equal borders around all four sides. Let me go out of the way. Then I'm going to lay my vellum on top because it's exactly the same as the other card base that I've got there. And my greeting is going to go right here. And I'm going to stick that down with liquid glue as well. So I'm just going to liquid glue that. And stick him down right here in the right hand side and then as vellum is see-through I'm just going to lift that up and now I'm going to apply adhesive to the back of my green in here so no one can see it and I'm going to stick this over the top of my patterned paper there and then I can stick this now to my card base So you can still see that this isn't sealed all the way around, but that's okay, it's sealed right there. Now to finish it off, I've got another piece of pattern paper here from the Petal Garden uh, Designer Paper Pack. And I'm going to select these little flowers right here. So I'm just cutting them out. And with my pair of paper snips, I'm going to cut right around as close to the edge as possible these two flowers out. And I want to stick this on my project somewhere. Right. So I might cut this flower off right here. And I'm going to stick this down using some liquid adhesive. And to finish it off, I'm just going to add a scattering of rhinestones here. And 
And there you have it. A quick and easy card using our petal garden designer series paper. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next week for our new Makeup Monday.